Hey everybody, we're back in round three. Um, this is my opponent. Taylor Griffith. Where are you from, Taylor? Fort Worth. Fort Worth. He's been playing Warriors of Chaos today. Tell us what's in your army. I know you're playing um, uh, Hell Cannon, War Shrine, Warriors Unit, Invulnerable, Chosen Bunker, Minimum Core, More Minimum Core. All right. Uh, he rolled his Favor of the Gods on his uh, Chosen. He got on the very first try. He got 12, so they have a 3-up Invulnerable and a Stubborn, so I'm going to have to deal with that. Yet again, unsurprisingly, I'm in a giant, long, Empire gun line. Uh, we're playing a scenario where there's six flags, and whoever has the most flags uh, will win. If you can look up the six flags over Texas, that'll make more sense to you. Uh, I took metal this round instead of fire. Uh, we'll see how that pays off, and we will see how much Empire can rock. Here at the end of Taylor's first turn, he broadly moved up. He gave the other unit of warriors MR3. Uh, his magic did nothing, or he did a gateway which killed four spearmen. Uh, I'd like to note he did a quagmire on the Lord's unit, and no one died because they are assholes in tights. So uh, we'll see what happens on my turn one. Right, here start. my turn one on an equally unspecular, unspecular turn. Spectacular. Uh, both cannons uh, misfired, didn't really do anything, came up just short of the Hell Cannon. Hellblaster uh, exploded but got 30 shots, which killed two Chosen, uh, and the crossbows did nothing. So we'll see what he can bring to the Rocket Empire. Right here at the end of Taylor's turn two. He cast Gateway again, but I scrolled it. He tried to boobos my lord, and I stopped it. He cast Plague Squall and overshot. His, uh, his uh, Hell Cannon freaked out and ran into some train and stopped. And he ran around and threw some throwing axes at me, so it's a very uneventful turn. So we will see what the Empire can rock. My turn there. two, the Knights moved around. The Steam Tank generated five points like a jerk again. Got in there, killed five Chosen, one combat. He's locked in with me now. Uh, my 21 shots of shooting with Port Nafar killed one single warrior. But well, the crossbows put... Oh, killed one. Oh, no, I killed zero because he made a save. And then I... Uh, but I did do two wounds to the War Shrine with crossbows. Um, and he saved... Because he saved the cannon shot. So it was a pretty uneventful turn, but, you know, you got to grind it out. So we will see what Empire... All right, his turn three resulted in four more guys dying to a... Uh, a big old gateway killing four spearmen. And he, he uh, plague squalled two guys, which I've never actually seen done. I uh, did a wound to the steam tank in combat, but whatever. Everything else is just moving along, so we'll continue to grind it out. We'll see you turn three. Yeah. All right, here at the end of my turn three, my wizard lord blew himself up thanks to the infernal puppet, uh, which is pretty pretty shitty. Um, and then uh, my knight's charging on the flank over there. Steam tank killed four or five more. Killed a couple marauders with bows. My cannons continued to uh, not be good. And one misfired for this turn and next, so we'll just continue on what's going on. So we'll see you. At the four was like the wackiest turn ever. His cannon fired, misfired, caused a miscast to everybody. Killed my other wizard lore. Kill, uh, caused him, caused this wizard to let him cast a spell. Cast gateway on the other level two with the dudes. Removed them, got the, the the portal open. Killed all of them. Then in the magic, fa then in the phase, I won combat against a stubborn rerolling Raptor standard chosen star who broke. But I only pursued five inches and, and didn't catch them. So who knows what the hell is going on now. So it'll be my turn. Right, on, hit, on my turn four, uh, I broke the Chosen Star, as you saw. I killed enough of them with a cannon shot so they couldn't rally. Plowed the Knights into the side where we tied after I did a wound to his wizard. Shot over here and he made an armor save. And we will see what he can pull out on turn You guys are back for game four. Ah! Uh, ah! Jordan Braun over there. Uh, this is my opponent. Uh, Jason Johnson. Jason Johnson, where are you from, Jason? Uh, Little Rock, Arkansas. Well, what are you playing today? Demons. All right, can you tell us what's in your list? Uh, Furies. I've got Fiends, Slamash, Horrors, Horrors, Second Level Cinch Herald, Horrors, Second Level Cinch Herald, Flesh Hounds, Demonettes, uh, BSB, Negative Leadership Banner, Four Man Unit of Flamers, uh, Keeper of Secrets, and a Unit of Fast Cap. All right, so. Got a little bit more terrain on this table with two woods. He's set up in a broad line. Looks like he's trying to run around again because my army is gigantic. For gun lines, it needs a long line again. So we'll see how this does, and we'll see what Empire can rock up in the first turn. Okay, here at the end of my first turn, my cannons guessed correctly, but only killed one harpy due to some bad rolls. I failed, rolled two ones to wound. Uh, Steam take advanced, killed a dog, uh, did a couple wounds to the dogs of corn, and uh, killed a horror or two, so it was very unexciting. Uh, we'll see what he can bring. Right, in his turn, he advanced in a broad line threatening all fronts. He miscast with one of his units, killing three horrors. Um, 
that was about it. So we'll see what I can rock yeah, it. My turn two started with a cannon blowing up and misfiring, a hellblaster blowing up and misfiring, the other cannon planting the ground and not doing anything, uh, both magic missiles having above average saves, 30 or 20 crosswomen shooting at his seekers, only killing two, the steam gun killing one. Uh, challenge over here, I won combat, but he took no wounds. Uh, overall, it's a very bad turn. He siren song my uh, outriders who uh, tried to flee just enough to get it not get off the table, and they failed and ran off the table. So we will see what we can work. All right, out. his turn two. Sorry. He uh, killed all my crossbows, ran off the table because uh, he, he has a banner that forces yep. me to hold. Uh, he did two wounds to the steam tank with a flicker fire. He assassinated one of my wizards with his fiends who exploded. His furies charging killed a cannon crewman. Through some, through some weird rolling and forgetting of rules, we uh, ended up blowing up one of those guys. Uh, and my knights, that lost their priest, but he rolled double sixes for leadership, so his big guy took four wounds. So we'll see what we can come up with. All right, on my turn, my cannon, again, was blocked by a ward save against the line of dogs, even though I underguessed. Crossbows added a wound, and the archers killed some stuff. We finished off the uh, seekers. Uh, the knights were broken by the big demon over there. Uh, Wizard Lord helped kill some wounds. All right, on his turn three, he charged my crossbows. They killed one on the way in and punched one more for a wound before they died. Uh, his flamers shot my spearmen and made them panic. Um, and that's about it at the moment. So we'll see what I can turn. I did four wounds to his uh, flamers with burning gaze. Killed one. Archers didn't help. Steam gun didn't help. Repeater pistol didn't help. Cannon again planted a, a cannonball to, uh, in the ground in front of his BSB. The archers managed to wound him, but he made his save. So uh, almost nothing happened. They rallied. So we'll see what he does in this turn five. So I'm wiping out the archers, but not overrunning into the cannon enough. So they get a reprieve. Stuff moved back on the table. Uh, not a whole lot happened this turn. So we'll see what I can work up on my turn five. I finally got into combat with the flamers. I killed him in close combat. I uh, did a cleansing flare. Killed a couple guys. My cannon again. Failed to do anything, even though he's right in front of me. I killed another guy with archers. Uh, we'll see what his turn five. His turn five saw him finally kill my cannon that had failed the entire game. Uh, he had uh, he flicked fired one guy to death. That was about it. So All right, we're here in round five, the final game. This is my opponent, Ben Burns, uh, author and creator of uh, Tales of Battle magazine, which you should check out, talesofbattle.com. And um, he's playing Skaven today. we got a unit of Plague Monks, some Sensor Bearers, Whole, uh, giant rats, whole bunch of units of slaves, a uh, health and abomination, a big bell, some Gisales, and a warp lightning cannon. Uh, I've tried something different here. He's got a couple large targets, so I'm gonna I deploy my outriders behind my line because I don't want them to get shot too much. Uh, we'll just see what we can do. And what the Empire on turn happen. one, I advance my wizards up uh, with the archers screening them. The steam tank generated four points to move up. Knights advanced cautiously. My cannon got a really good shot through the center of his bell unit, but failed to wound the bell. Uh, the other cannon ended up short. I did some shooting and killed some slaves. Not really anything. His turn one, the hell pit uh, blasted forward 14 inches. Everything else generally advanced. We've got some guy, he's got some guys sneaking in the woods over here. He shot his warp landing cannon, almost clipped the steam tank, and instead killed three crossbowmen. This giant rat's adv advanced towards my knights. Uh, magic was a trade. He made me use the scroll. And we'll see what we can do. Right, here in my turn two, my cannon misfired while shooting at the hell pit way over there. But the other one hit it, but rolled a one to wound it again. Uh, did some various shooting, causes a panic, nothing really fancy, steam tank advanced. My knights charged into the giant rats, killed all of them, ran them down. Um, almost overran to the warp lightning cannon. Um, not a whole lot of help. Magic up burned his last scroll, so we'll see what that gets us next turn. Alright, and we will see what the Empire can rock up in turn two. Okay, here on his turn, uh, he charged my knights in the rear with his plague sensors. He, I lost uh, three and my champion to... Uh, to the toughness test, but he lost three of his guys, uh, and then I punched some and won, so that was pretty bad, but failed to break them, failed to run them down. Uh, over here, he fired the Doom Rocket and killed a piece of each unit, but not enough to cause panic, which was very fortunate. Did another wound to the steam tank, and rang the bell to reroll leadership. Used his last scroll and his Doom Rocket, so we'll see what my turn three brings. All right, my turn three, I charged the fleeing sensor bearers and ran them off the table. Managed to cast Unbreakable on myself. Kind of reformed my gun line, shot a bunch of the clan rats to death. My steam tank climbed the hill and steam gunned them. Um, miscast my wizard, taking a wound and killing a couple more guys, but nothing bad happened. Archers and the gutter runners had a fight in the woods. It was pretty funny. And uh, at the moment, nothing else is really going on. We'll see what he can cook up.